19 days until Halloween. Can you believe that? Well, if you're looking for ways to be Halloween inspired, how about over seven thousand glowing jack-o-lanterns like I'm trying to picture that it seems amazing they're all hand carved and staring at you well, sounds like my kind of party magic of the jack-o-lanterns is back at Hudson Gardens and Dan Daniel McCullough is here with all the scoop it's good to see you Daniel nice to see you well tell us all about this event because it just seems amazing yeah this is our second year at Hudson Gardens there's a trail walk through of 7,000 or more, I stopped counting about 6,000, <laughs> uh, yes. glowing jack-o'-lanterns and other displays. We have uh, a lot of different pop culture themes that we thrive on. We have dinosaurs, we have under the sea, we have pirates, skeletons, and we're constantly working to add new stuff to the trail every weekend. That's very cool. Well, I have to ask, how do you get to 7,000 hand-carved pumpkins, jack-o'-lanterns. We have a lot of artists that work on it throughout the year to get Do there. You? Yes, oh my absolutely. Goodness. That is a lot. Well, is this a family-friendly event? Oh, what absolutely, people, yes. What yes. do people expect when they get there? Well, I mean, we have a great trail. There's plenty of, to look at. We have tons of vi uh, food vendors, bars, okay. and uh, different refreshments on the trail to have. So definitely bring the family out Absolutely. and the kids. As a matter of fact, over the weekend, I was thinking about my two girls. What can we do that's not too scary for them? Not scary at and all. And it's family friendly. Well, this is perfect. Yep. So what is new this year? Because you guys are back for the second time. Well, we have a lot more jack-o'-lanterns. We've carved mm -hmm. more and uh, more displays. We have some animated pumpkins that you'll see along the trail, singing, laughing, telling jokes. Uh, there's a lot of light displays that we've added. Um, there's a giant jack-o'-lantern house that's on the trail which is cool um, so and like I said we're constantly working to put new stuff on the trail every weekend it just sounds so much fun okay tell me about the pumpkins what are they made of so most of our carvings are all forever pumpkins so okay. that way we don't have to worry about the animals and along Hudson Gardens yeah. coming eating all the jack-o'-lantern so okay. we do have real jacks but most of them are forever pumpkins is like what we like to call them so who carves them and where does the inspiration come from do you guys kind of stick to different themes or does everybody do what they're envisioning how does it work well we have certain themes like I said the dinos dinosaur zone so all those carvings will be dinosaur driven um, and then a lot of the pop culture themes that we use are inspired by our artists or sure. you know what's current so like the Mandalorian has made an appearance on the trail baby Yoda has been <laughs> on the trail as well so um, but yeah, there's tons of artists that work on them and everybody has a little bit of their own inspiration into the carvings. Super cool. So you never know what you're going to see. Absolutely. Right? So what would, what would you say are some of your favorite? Oh, I don't know. I would think I really enjoy the animated pumpkins that are laughing and singing. Uh, they're just fun to watch. They're a showstopper. Oh, I want to see those. Well, why do you think people should come out with their families, their friends, make it a date night to Magic of the jack I don't think there's any better way to celebrate the fall season and get into the Halloween spirit. I, this is one great way to do it. Absolutely. Okay. And one thing I wanted to ask you is how long does it take from start to finish? Just kind of a ballpark. I would say most people um, at the pace that I've been seeing take about 45 minutes to walk the okay. trail. Okay, very cool. And then you said there's food on site. There's, there's definitely a okay. lot of good food. That is wonderful. Okay, what is the best way to get tickets? What time does does the, does do the doors open? Oh yeah, so we we open at sunset, which typically right now is about 6:30. Okay. Um, tickets have been selling out every night that we're open, so you need to buy your tickets online before you get there. Okay, good advice. Go to the website and buy those tickets, and we're gonna have that info for you in just a sec. But I want to ask because I've got the two my two girls. What have kids been enjoying the most this year? Oh, I think by far their favorite favorite has been the uh, animated pumpkins. Oh, yeah. That sounds like so much fun. Well, we can't wait to get out there. Thank you so much, Daniel, for being with us this yeah, morning. Yeah, thank you for having me. Yeah. Okay, guys, here is the deal. Don't miss magic of the jack-o'-lanterns at Hudson Gardens in Littleton. Walk through over a walk through a trail of glowing pumpkins. We're talking 7,000 carved pumpkins or more, as Daniel said. It's going on now until October the 31st. For information, just go to magicofthejackolanterns.com.